follow me Who's amazed with Jesus and his majesty Raising our daughter in reality And there's no other place that we rather be Through the fun and the snuggles, the cries and the struggles Praising God through the good and the troubles This is life on the real guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jennifer if you're new please consider subscribing so you don't miss any of my videos I usually try to post Thursdays and Sundays you can also follow me in my Instagram at life with Zayla just like the YouTube channel's name and this is part two of what I love my current favorites and recommendations for my toddler stay tuned let me kind of mention to you the brand that I was using the detergent when she was a newborn all the way into she was one and let me show you well I, like i said i'm not using the detergent anymore but i do use the um body wash and head wash lotion and kind of conditioner spray so this is the noodle and boo this is the two-in-one um hair and body wash i love this smell and brand this is probably the best that I've smelled and it's so good I I've used this with Zayla since she was born till now like guys it smells so good like when my husband smells her like let's say if I lather lotion or she takes a bath or I do her hair she, she he always says oh you smell so good she smells so good I actually tried this I didn't even know about this brand but I I remember when I was pregnant um, I think I got some samples. I don't remember from where. I don't know if it was from maternity, from that store of maternity, motherhood from in the mall where they sell maternity clothes, where I got it in one of those little registry bags that they give you when you do registry. I really don't remember, but I remember there was a little sample and, and I think it was the lotion. So those are the little things that they come in a little party and kind of lift up and you can smell. And when I smelled this, I was like, what is this scent? It smells so, 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 so good. I looked it up and I was like, this is the one I want for my daughter. And honestly, like this goes a long, long way. I think, well, let me show you. This is the lotion. Which looks exactly the same, just as lotion. It says super soft lotion, and it's super soft, definitely. And this is the conditioning spray. It says leave in conditioning, hair polish, and you know, because my daughter sometimes wakes up with bed head, like her hair is everywhere. This smooths this out, and she smells the smell, guys. It's the smell that gets me every time. The smell, it's so so good. It's like I can't describe it. You just need to. Um, take my word for it. I did see recently that they had it in some targets. They don't have like the, I don't think they have the lotion. Was it the lotion? Yeah, I don't think they have the lotion for sure. They don't have the conditioning spray, but they have the body wash there. And I think they even have like a different color of a bottle. I don't know if it's a different set, but this is the one that you guys need to go and smell. If you have a local target, check if they have it there. For sure they have it online. But Bye Bye Baby has like the whole line to say. That's where I would get the detergent. This is the same detergent that I would get. And for the for the body lotion, like you don't need a lot for it to smell good. You don't need a lot for her skin to be smooth and soft. Like I think this, honestly, without lying, I think it lasts me a year. Like honestly, or really, really close to a year. That's how long the body lotion has lasted me. On the body wash, I don't really remember. Um, but I have had to obviously repurchase it, but it smells good, but it does last me a while and it's not super expensive. I think it just depends like what's your budget or what you want to spend. But I believe this is like $69.99. It's like $20 for sure at most. But let me tell you that it's so worth it. You use it for a long, long time. And the smell, man, just the smell alone, it's worth it. I even have a little travel size little lotion because it's so good. It's like so delicious and I just love that smell. And now that I'm having a second baby, even if it's a boy or girl, I'm still putting, I'm still gonna use that lotion and all that line because it's so good guys, like definitely. So check it out. Next I wanna share this Dref pen and I should have shared it with the Dref, Dref, 
um, scent boosters, but it's okay. So this, guys, it's if your little baby or toddler spills something on them and it's an outfit or shirt that you really don't want them to get stained, you just open it up, kind of press it on there, rub it on there, and it takes it completely out. I have used this with Zayla a couple of times, not a lot. Um, thankfully, I try to be very careful with um, the things I give her if it's like a special shirt or I don't want to get her, you know, or I don't want it to get dirty. But it works. It has not failed me when I've needed it. So I truly recommend these. I think this is like three bucks. I'm pretty sure. It's not more than five, that's for sure. But this is something that you can throw in your diaper bag if you're out and that happens, just put it on. Put it on really classy. <laughs> You'll be good. Next thing I want to share, and if I'm going a little fast, it's because I don't want this video to be extremely long, so bear with me. But it's the Baby Ganics SPF 50 Sunscreen Spray. Um, I've used this with Zayla last summer, and it's perfect. It's thick, but it's not like too thick that it's just like it stays on their skin. It just looks weird, and um, it smells good. And I like that it's a spray instead of like the one that you have to like squeeze and it's, you know like a lotion. I don't know. I just like the fact that it's like I can spray it on her and kind of just rub it all over her body. Um, like I said, I did use it. I went to the pool and the beach with her and I love this and I love that it's 50. So that's perfect. And the beautiful thing about Baby Organics is that it's very, very natural. It doesn't have all the junk that it shouldn't have. And um, it's one of the less harmful things that you can put on your little toddler's body. So I truly recommend this. If you haven't tried it, go ahead and try it. You can find it everywhere. Target, Walmart, Walgreens, CVS. I'm pretty sure they have it all online. Nowadays, everything. Amazon. Yeah. You know it. Moving on to... I want to share with you guys the Honest Baby Multi-Surface Fragrance Free. And this is like a cleanser like a cleaner like an all-purpose spray pretty much so i spray her high chair her little changing table like when i clean her room this is what i use and i love that it's fragrance free because i'm not really a fan of fragrance like i'm very particular with the fragrance that i like and it says that it's made without all the bad stuff no chloride bleach bleach dyes all the stuff that is bad chemicals that other um, multi-surface sprays could carry this one doesn't is very clean so I really like that and I think I got this oh if it wasn't when Taylor was born it was like when she was like small like she was like I think like maybe three months like and I still have it it's still full and I have another one in a caddy here for the living room this is the one that was in her room because I like to wipe down her table and her changing table so super good i recommend it and it will last you a long long time like it's worth it i don't remember how much i paid for it because it's been that long but trust me it's like a one-time purchase almost because you get so much use out of it and it just lasts you so much so truly recommend that i also wanted to share the wipes that i've used with Sela ever since she was pretty much born and this is the brand it's they're the water wipes and honestly these are the best wipes in the skin it's really sensitive just like mine maybe even more because you know as a newborn and babies their skin is just so sensitive and i've tried other brands i won't name them because i don't want you know maybe you guys use them so i ain't gonna name them and every baby's different maybe your baby is just has a little bit of a stronger skin who knows but they they make her skin red and it's, it's, it just is too hard for her skin but these have never 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 done that and i just love that they're here that they're it's water and it's like 99 percent water and then one drop drop of fruit extracts well that's like so clean especially especially when they're newborns like their skin i just remember zayla's skin it's so sensitive like they're so sensitive you're just like ah especially when you're a first time mom you're like i don't want to break you but anyways i still use these with her they are the best wipes honestly i really recommend these if you're able to get them get them especially for your baby's skin because it's sensitive and you know you don't want to put anything on their little booties i mean at least i don't so water wipes it's worth ah. 
Now I'm gonna move on to a learning toy. I mean, she has several, but I just wanted to show you guys this. I truly like this and I recommend this. This is a little picnic basket. I believe it's from Fisher Price. Don't quote me, maybe not. But, oh, I'm sorry, it's right here, Leapfrog. I'm sorry, it's from Leapfrog. And this is just a little picnic basket. It comes with a little fruit, but what I like is that it tells you, like, put it in a circle where I'm hungry, and then it goes right in, and they could open it up and get it. And it teaches them, like, the shapes and stuff like this. Like, I'm really into learning to learn oh Lord. learning toys because their brain is a little sponge. And I want Zayla to learn as much as she can with everything she can. And if she could play and learn, that's perfect. And I really, really like this. Um, like I said, it sings, it does all these stuff, and it could become a little annoying when you know they sing too much, but you know what? It's worth it because like I said, they're learning, and I believe this is something like probably like 20 bucks or less, so it's not expensive at all, and they're gonna learn as they play. So I recommend this also staying in that department um there's a couple books that i want to share just two guys don't worry not ten <laughs> all right first i'm going to show you guys this one this is a princess book and this one is pretty cool because it has magnets when i bought it on this little circle it came with a little thing like a little stack of magnets and pretty much what you do is you could um let me see if i get open you, you just put them on the little, like where they go. And then it has a story of, a little story of each princess. Like this one is Rapunzel. And you can put them on here. Now Zayla has them everywhere. I think I saw one though when I was looking through it. It also has Ariel. Um, and it has Belle. She likes Belle. She can recognize Belle. She sees Belle. She'll be like, Belle? 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 She's so cute. And I kind of want her like Belle. I like Belle. Like one of my favorite movies is Beauty and the Beast. It's Aladdin and Beauty and the Beast. Like they're my top favorite movies. I can watch, watch, and watch. Expose. And I was like, oh, she likes Belle. Like she has some Belle dolls. But she likes Belle. So I know, sidetrack, but I just want to share that with you guys. So as you guys see, like this right here, um, it's a little magnet. So she could just put it on and she could put it on the fridge. I think she has Belle on the fridge actually. So it's pretty cool. It has like the little characters from like, the Disney princess and I really like this. She really enjoyed it, but of course they're everywhere. Hopefully that she didn't lose them, but I recommend this. I got this at Burlington, so I probably won't be able to link it because you can't link stuff from Burlington, but if you're like Burlington Ross, Marshalls, go to the book section. Maybe they'll have something like this or if not the same one. And also this one, this is my mom got it for her at Sam's. And like I said, learning and reading is perfect for kids. They really recommend for you to read to them as much as you can because their brain will develop um, faster and they just grasp a lot. It's been, I guess it's been proven that parents that read to their kids are just smarter. That's what I've, that's what my pediatrician told me. So. Um, so here, basically, it says, let's learn one, two, three. So basically, you put one, I don't know if this one is on. Yeah, so you see? So it says, one happy drummer. It kind of plays a little no the drum noise, and it says it right here, one happy drummer, and then it'll be two big trucks, and they'll probably use the horn, then owls is three. So it's not only showing them numbers, but it's showing them the animals, and I really, really like this because like I said, she could touch it and she could read. And my daughter actually really likes books. Like she loves books. She calls them B, why? I don't know, but I always tell her book, book. But she likes to look through the books. She likes you to read them, sometimes too much. Like she will read them and then she'll want you to read them again and again. And I'm like, ah. but it's a good thing. You know, I shouldn't complain because it's a good thing. She really likes books, she enjoys them. So this is something that it would be very, very ben, um, beneficial and on the back it says uh, number recognition it says fine motor skills and sound recognition so it has all those things and these are the other books that they also carry if you're interested ABC's first words and then the book that I have one two three so this is very 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 um, worth your money especially because it's helping them as their little brains grow and develop. So 
truly, truly recommend that. And then moving on, I'm just trying to make sure to these little things. I I talked about this in my diaper bag, but really quickly, I recommend these little placemats as you're out in the restaurant, in a fast food place, wherever you are. Just just lay them on right on the table. They have the little sticky things, one on top, one in the bottom. You lay them on there. You can put the food or you can put the plate, whatever you are. And it's just, a, you know, just a way to be more safe, sanitized, whatever you want to call it. I really like these. I try to keep at least three in my diaper bag. And these are actually from the, um, Dollar Tree. So they're a dollar. They bring, I believe it says, it brings 10. It brings 10. And yeah, the design is kind of like sea and monster and maybe even boyish. But for a dollar, I'm good with that. So I truly recommend these. And I still have some. So that's good. And then also, I have this right here. These are the four mini mouse four pack disposable changing pads. They come in a four pack. You can kind of lay it on the changing table. Um, if you don't happen for whatever reason to carry your little changing mat, this is something that you throw on there. I try to carry one always because you never know. And it's perfect, it's mini, Just, it works. And also from Dollar Tree. And then I also have my mat. This is from Fond Design. And I love this, I have the clutch too. And it's perfect because you can just wipe this down it's leather you, there's no worry if it gets stained by any chance you can just get some cleaning spray and just wipe it down and it's good as new and it doesn't take up too much room then you can just hold it up and clip it and you're pretty much good to go um, I got there's different colors I got the black one as you guys know if you haven't seen what's in my color diaper bag go ahead and check it out but I have uh, like a blush pink one and then I have which is the smaller size and then I have a gray one which I haven't shown because I, I don't need that anymore since Ayla is a toddler but I will soon because baby number two is on its way so I got the gray one in the bigger size and those are probably one of the best diaper bags honestly the best um I've seen different ones and they're good too like if you have a different one you love oh, that's awesome but I truly recommend Fawn Design which is the brand from my um changing mat because it's very very sturdy it's easy to wipe down you can fit a lot even on the smaller size you can fill up fit a lot that's the one i'm carrying now actually so check out their website and sometimes they have some sales going on i don't know every what but yeah you just keep an eye on that if you're interested go ahead and check it out this is very very convenient to have and i truly truly recommend it and i think we have two more things and we're done guys all right um actually three more things i almost forgot this but this is another thing that i use for de La sippy cup and i've mentioned this like a lot of times in my hauls and my grocery hauls whatever um this is just perfect obviously you know you have to replace these because they're not like a one of these sippy cups that they're just you know they're pretty much meant forever until they don't work anymore but this is very convenient because it's slimmer and water doesn't come out like unless you bang on it which they just started to realize that a little bit of water comes out but it's nothing crazy and if she wants to drink water she could just suck on these these do come with like fruit like um like it's juice like this is great but i don't give her any juice or soda or nothing like that i just give my daughter purely water because i want to keep her on water as much as i can it's just healthier just has a lot of sugar soda no way it's so unhealthy i don't even like i don't drink soda at all i don't like soda i know you're like shocked i know some people get shocked when i tell them i don't like soda i haven't liked soda for I think since I was like 11, 12, I don't know. One day I taste Coke and I was like, this is disgusting. And I just don't like soda. Sometimes, sometimes I'll drink. Um, but this is not even like, I feel like the older I got, like, it's been less, but the crushed orange. But that's like, I think I used to do that more when I was in high school. But I sometimes do drink the very Sprite. Um, McDonald's carries that because it tastes pretty good. But that's like, rare i don't like you won't find soda in my house unless we're having someone over and they like soda most people like soda i don't like it at all so i probably won't let zayla try soda until she's like 
I don't even know because Jose, he, I think he could drink soda, but he's not a fan of it. Like, like I said, we don't have soda here. It's fine. He likes iced tea, which I don't know. Is that considered soda? Maybe I don't know. But that's what he likes. I don't like and I would drink. I would drink iced tea, but this in this pregnancy, uh, I pretty much just drink only water because that's the only thing I crave or like horchata stuff like that. But that's another story for another time. But. It's water, so yes, guys, I truly recommend this. It's really good, um, and it's like three dollars. So if you want to have something that doesn't take up so much room in your diaper bag, try checking these out. Even if you need the juice or not, whatever you do, it's great. But I recommend this pretty greatly. All right, so two more things and we are done. So I want to share this with you guys because this has really been one of my favorite tennis shoes for Zayla. Um, these are the what are they called the strident i believe 360 and these shoes are so good because they kind of mold your kids feet and they help them walk when they're starting to walk they're just sturdy and they're just perfect for them as they starting to take their little steps now this she uses these almost every day so you can tell she's you know these need have some love on them i am planning her i'm planning to get her a second pair because you know when you use something all the time is bound to you know uh, get a lot of use out of it and start falling apart but so far these are still perfect i really like these they're they're not i don't know if you would consider these super expensive in my opinion they're like kind of in the middle they're about 30 35 dollars just depending on the type of tennis shoes that you get there's more expensive i don't know if there's less expensive maybe if there's a sell but honestly, to help your kid walk, especially when they're learning, Zayla already knows how to walk, like she runs now. But in the beginning, like I truly recommend these shoes because they will help your baby walk better. And just how it molds their feet, I think it's just a plus. And like I said, if something's gonna help your kid out, you know, why not? But whatever you guys wanna do, I'm just sharing what works for me. And lastly, it fell thing is another game now um and lastly uh, i want to share with you guys one of my favorite bow companies because zayla always wears a bow she is that's just how i do her hair and she leaves it on i've taught her from early age to leave on her bow so hoping that she sticks with her for as long as i'm gonna do a bow on her but this is from one of the SD shops and it's so cute it's a little unicorn it's called little sparklers boutique and i will leave her estate shop down below but i really she has like maybe the majority of her bowls are from this shop they're super super nice very very um good quality i really really like them i have this one and this because i haven't opened it yet and i decided to get this one to show you guys since it had the little name on here which i don't know if you can see it so much because of the, like the bow but this is just what I use for Zayla's bows. If you've seen her bows, maybe on Instagram or if you've seen her on my blogs, that's pretty much the bow, especially for like a special occasion. Those are the bows that I tend to use. I also have bows from like Walmart and Burlington, Marshalls, of course, you know, from anywhere. Like it's not only from there but those are my favorite just because of how they're made and how they look they're very very cute they are probably from to the pricier side for the bow but you know to each their own that's just you know one of my favorites probably the favorite um bow brands for zayla so yes guys that is pretty much it i know it's been a long video and if you're still <laughs> if you're still um here props to you i did also wanted to share um Zayla sound machine and Zayla sleeping sack but you know what i'm looking at the at my little camera and this video is like really really long so i'll probably save that for another video maybe things that i love for my toddler when she goes to sleep i'm not sure but we'll see but for now this is pretty much it so guys like i said before if you're new please consider subscribing um i would love for you to join the fam and if you're not following me follow me on instagram it's called life with zayla just like my youtube channel and hopefully i'll see you guys here for my next video stay safe